YouTube, it's your girl Brivert, and I'm back with another YouTube video. Before I get into this video, you guys already know what to do. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And let's get straight into this video. As you can tell by the title, this video is going to be about a new hair company, guys. Yes, a brand new hair company. This is my first time working with them and we're gonna see what they're about because you guys already know i'm gonna tell y'all the truth i'm not gonna sit up here and lie for no reason okay i'm not a liar i'm a child of god hallelujah so let's get straight into this video i'm talking too much okay so i already took the hair out of the box and stuff y'all know how i am i don't have time to wait so the hair came in this box as you can see it says Nike his hair on it so it came in this black box it came with two wig hats as you can see they're pretty light so you know and then it comes with a little nice little message for the um for the customer it comes with this nice message okay so this was inside of the wig and the wig was also wrapped in this net I know y'all can see that this black net so this is what the wig came inside of and then it was also in this plastic bag wigs are starting to come in plastic bags these days i don't know if it's like a new thing because of like the pandemic but hey um i'm not complaining because that's where i'm going to put the bag and then put it away in my wig area and it also came with elastic like this is my first time having a wig company give me a wig and give me the elastic i can put on the wig to make the wig lewis so i was really excited about this um it also came with this nice pink silk bag to put the wig in when you want to put it away so yeah it was cute packaging no cap it was really cute packaging i like the packaging everything was nice clean no smell we love to see it period okay so let me show you guys the hair this is the hair color color hold on color i'm gonna say 1b and then to 613 as you can see so it's an ombre dark roots whatever you want to call it type of thing let me tell you guys the um the rest of the details of the hair this hair is 10 inches and it's free part 150 density so free part is like this is not a closure wig this is a lace front i believe it's 13 by 4 it's not 360 i don't really go for 360 wigs anymore because i'm never putting my hair up if it's in a wig if, it, if i have a wig on i'm not putting my hair up so this is 13 by 4 as you can see 13 and then by 4 period so let me show you guys the inside this is the inside of the wig. It has one, two, three, four combs. Y'all already know the drill. I'm gonna show you all the combs. And then it has this elastic at the back as well to adjust it to your head size. Cause some of us have big heads. Hello? I have a big head, okay? Don't laugh. Cause I'm sure your daddy got a big head. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, so yeah, I like it. You know, you already know what I, I have to do. As you can see, this wig, let me put the, the brightness down so y'all can see. This wig is very much yellow. It's giving very much Karen vibes. It's yellow, like it looks really yellow. I'm probably gonna insert a different clip just so y'all can see what I'm talking about because I don't think you can tell, but it's super yellow. But yeah, it's super yellow and I don't like that. I don't I don't want my wig to like look yellow and stuff. I want my blonde wig to look toned. And so you guys already know what I'm gonna use to tone my wigs. Let me show you just in case. To tone my 613 units, I use the Shimmer Light Shampoo Purple. It's a purple shampoo for blonde and silver hair, period. And it's gonna tone this wig. It's gonna take it from yellow to like, oh, y'all can see it, yeah. Y'all can see it looks very much yellow. So it's going to take this hair from yellow to like toned, silverish type of vibe, okay? So I'm going to go tone the hair and I'm going to come back with my commentary. But yeah, this is the wig, guys. It has a whole lot of body. 
it's definitely 10 inches definitely 10 inches and it's definitely one I don't want to say it's 150 density but it's not too far off it's not too thin it's not too thick it's pretty good I would say it's like 140 density yeah like 140 they said it was 150 but it's like 140 but it's not bad like it's thick enough it's not thin it's thick so yeah guys that thing moving honey stiff wear per but anyways like i said i'm gonna go tone the hair and i'm gonna pluck it and show you guys oh before i forget let me show you guys the hairline because i almost forgot this is the hairline guys so as you can see or maybe not this hairline honey it's thick okay this hairline is thick the lace is also light so i'm gonna have to like you know deal with that as well and i'm gonna show you guys how i do all that okay but the front of it is plucked a little bit and it comes with baby hairs i know y'all can see that yeah so yeah the hairline is really thick not plucked at all so you're gonna have to go in with tweezers and pluck 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 your wig I'm tired of people walking around with helmet heads. <laughs> you need to pluck your wig, okay? We need to be able to see it. It's a free part. Use it, okay? So like I said, I'll be back after I tone this wig. What's up, guys? So I am back. As you can see, I changed my wig from the one I had on earlier. It's still a work in progress, but I do have to get somewhere. And I also have a change of scenery. Don't mind that. There's a lot going on today, okay? But let me show you guys how the wig looks now that i have um toned it with the shimmer light shampoo so this is how the hair looks now i don't know if you guys can tell but it's super white it's giving more of a toned and less of a yellow brassy thing look it's giving more of a toned white ash blondish type of vibe and that's exactly what i was going for um I do have a few things to say about the wig. So let me just show you guys how it looks right now. I straightened it, plucked it, all that. As you can see, the hair is as healthy as it's gonna be after it's been bleached, processed, dyed, and then I use shimmer lights on it. So this is it's still pretty good in quality, still good in body, still moves, you know, it's pretty nice. But I do have a few cons about this wig. So. My first con about the wig is going to have to be the dye job. Now, I'm going to insert clips of me wearing the hair, um, made videos about the hair. I actually have a post up on my Instagram. My Instagram name is at Britvert. You can go on there to see the post I made about the hair. Um, the dye job is not the best. Um, as you guys can see here, it's not the best. Um, when I saw, when I had the wig coming, they said dark roots. This is more of an ombre wig. This is not a dark roots wig because the dye, the um, 1B color has gone almost halfway down the wig. So this is more of an ombre type of look. This is not a dark roots wig. If you're looking for a wig that only the roots are dark, this is probably not the wig for you. But if you are looking for a wig where it's brown all around the perimeter it's just brown and then it goes to blonde this is the wig for you so the dye job was not the best but it also was not the worst i still wore it i still got many compliments on it people still loved how the wig looked on me but the dye job i can i have to be honest it's not the best it's just not the best dye job let me show you guys the back you see it's just it looks different on one side than on the other and that bothers me because when i wear wigs and when i review wigs i have to be honest you know so it's a good wig it's okay there's nothing like you know borderline bad about it minimal shedding it doesn't overshed. plucking was easy the lace is all right it's really just the dye job which i don't like i like the wig and i'm most likely going to dye it a different color 
just because I feel like the dye job with the blonde, you could just, the mistakes are just too loud. You can just see all the mistakes. Literally, this side looks completely different from this side, and both sides look completely different from the back. So, yes, I'm probably going to dye the wig. But this is the wig, girl, ladies. This is the wig. And like I said, y'all will see the clips of how it looked on me, and you guys will see all that. It was beautiful. It looked really good. I made it. It came together. But that's my one con about this wig is the dye job. I just really, personally, I don't like it. I i hate it um yeah but that's just the that's the one con but you guys know i'm gonna keep it real with you okay so thank you guys so much for watching this youtube video make sure you like comment and subscribe and let me know let me know if you guys have any questions about this wig or any other wig in any other of my videos i answer very fast i am very much responsive i interact with my subscribers you can dm me any platform, I will answer you, okay? Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Blessings.